All right, listen, everybody, I'm really excited that there's so many people in jazz band this year, but the fact is there's just too many. So really, there's only one logical way that I can think of to get rid of some of you. You're probably wondering why I called you all here. As you know, there's only one way to settle this whole debacle, and that is to have a survival-style competition. Awesome. What are you doing? I'm ready to be the next apprentice. Awesome. Survivor. Survivor? Oh, come on! As I was saying, six teams, one goal, to become the Weed Sport Jazz Band. I can't take this pressure! So Mr. Franco thinks that there's too many people in Jazz Band now, and he set up this Survivor thing to eliminate some of us, um, and a bunch of challenges were created, and this is what we've become. Flutes, the tribe has spoken. I think Pepsi has a great thing going. Well, it's got a lot of zinc. It does have a lot of zinc. Hold on. But, but Coke's smooth. Hold, Hold on. on. So Nate, he's all by himself and he keeps winning? He has no teammates. He's trained with nobody. Why does he keep winning? It's not fair. What is that? Like... Okay, if we're talking about me, need to get more angry. Because this is ridiculous! I don't understand. He's one Nate? person. Nate? Nate? Yeah, Nate. Nate. Clarinets, the tribe has spoken. The rhythm section needs to stop winning things. They need to work for them. They can't just be handed everything. I mean, Bill Gates, Kim Kardashian. All right, let's compare the two. Bill Gates worked hard, made Microsoft, and now he's a billionaire. Kim Kardashian, what did she do? So if they win, I'm just going to be ticked because we have trained day in and day out in the hot blazing sun. It's 85 degrees. You see these bandanas soaked with sweat. I do want some more pizza. I'll some pizza. Alright, right, let's go get some pizza. Yeah. We're all fat. <laughs> Trombone, the tribe has spoken. I can't take this trumpet section anymore. I, I just can't do it. Why? Why are they wearing camo? That's not even a color. It's a color scheme. Oh my god. We're just sick of them. I just, Ricky, look at him. He's all, I play trumpet, I'm number one. He's short, and for some reason he's always wet. Lucas, can you, uh... Oh yeah, guys, I got the stool for you. Alright, thanks, buddy. I'm feeling a little small today. So we're talking about the saxophones. Yeah, yeah. I really hate the saxophones. You know who I really hate all the saxophones? I hate Dan Sears. Oh, yeah. Why? Oh, my God. It's horrible. He, first of all, he plays a tenor sax. Who do you think they are? They just blare all the time. They think they're so good. Just because I'm a small guy. You know, it's not fair. You can't hold that against me. I mean, if I get in a challenge with Ricky, he's going down. It's as simple as that. It's an explosion. Yeah. yeah. Oh, man. Explosions. If I go against him, I think I'm going to punch him in the face. Straight well, up. Hey, hey, It'll be war. Hey, all out war. Bigger man. All right. I'll push him over and then I'll punch him in the face. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we're in a dead heat. We're in the final challenge, the Golden Snitch Challenge. The first person who catches Jackson Cherko will be the winner. Saxophones, who will be your representative? Dan! Mm. Trumpets, who will be your representative? I nominate myself. Wait, Rick, you don't want to vote or anything? No. We are a team. Oh. No. Really? Yep. Oh. All right. Okay, I guess you guys can go. Okay, gentlemen, shake hands. The Golden Snitch Challenge is a winner-take-all event. Ricky and Dan have been selected by other tribes to compete in this final competition.
the doctors, and I was like, this really hurts. I mean, oh my gosh. Hey, hi. <laughs> no, what? <laughs> Zach, you caught the golden snitch. Congratulations, rhythm section. You are the jazz band. Nice. Sweet. <laughs> oh, why are you guys all sweaty? <laughs> <laughs>